Hey y'all, I'm back with cycle seven update. So y'all know that my last like cycle was long as crap, like super long, super duper long. But um, AF came, normal days, went away. I started um, OPKs on cycle day 12. I usually ovulate between cycle day 16 and 19. I didn't ovulate until cycle day 29. Mind you, I'm on my way to Powerhouse. I'm getting ready, about to leave. I'm, so I'm just said, let me test because I had like a little, you know, crimp or whatever, a little ovulation crimp. Tested, it was positive. So we baby danced probably three days before that. But being though I didn't know that I was going to ovulate, I just figured I just wasn't going to ovulate this month. Um, we only baby danced three days before and then the day of and then the next day and the next day and the next day. <laughs> um, I used, I didn't have egg YCM, so I used um, pre-seed the day after ovulation. So I ovulated on Friday, on Saturday was when I used the pre-seed. So I don't know. Um, I think I'm going to start testing at 8 DPO. So we'll see what happens but this month I didn't have any weird stuff happening um right now I got a couple bumps on my face but nothing serious nothing like drastic more than usual or anything like that um I did take the Vitex all cycle I took the maca sporadically like I in the beginning when I was trying to get AF to come I would take it every day once AF got here I took it every day and then after that, it just started, like, dwindling. I would only take it, drink it, like, put it in my coffee or stuff like that. If I was drinking, like, the um, raspberry leaf tea, I would put it in a tea. But the stuff doesn't have a good taste to it. So I wasn't, like, taking it probably how I should have been. Um, my husband takes it, though. He puts it in his um, daily shakes, his little pro protein shakes or whatever. So he takes it, but I don't like it. I was thinking about capsulating it. So if anybody has ever done that, just, you know, let me know how that worked for them. Um, if this cycle doesn't work out, then I'll try it again next cycle consistently and probably capsulate it because it's nasty. I mean, it's not totally disgusting where it's just unbearable, but I'd rather not. But yeah, that's it for cycle seven. See you guys next. Well, I'll tell you guys when I test this month. I know you guys like to see the live pregnancy test, so I'll test. All right.